Hi guys, so today I'm gonna do a short review in a Lexus IS300H So basically this is just the normal model It's not the F-Sport And this is how it looks like at the center console This car actually drives pretty decent like It's actually sufficient power like Compared to the IS250 that I've got, the V6 engine, this one actually like moves really quick but I don't really like how all the sound is artificial and how the power output because this is just like a more powerful Toyota Prius I guess and I actually don't really like the idea but this is a car that Lexus loaned to me for a day because my IS250 is being serviced I'm just gonna show you guys how this car picks up it's actually quite fast off the line but not sure if you guys can hear the sound I'm just gonna do a short 0 to 100 video for you guys. Not sure if you guys can hear. I'll show you guys the interior right here because it's more sunny this is the steering wheel feels really nice to touch and that's the GPS there's actually quite a lot of things to play with here if like your phone the climate control the map and the audio and the display and that's your clock and this is like a kind of I don't know, it's a te textured matter and you have this for your volume and this is for changing of your tracks on your music and they have this snow button which is used for snow and this is the full electric mode traction control valve, sports mode which you turn here eco mode and push down for normal this actually changes how much rpm your car can rev up to i think but it doesn't do much it actually uh, increases the volume 
of the artificial noise in your car when you put it to spot and if you want your car to remain quiet you just turn it to eco it will be they will, they will switch off the volume and you have air conditioned seats and heated seats I set it to heated seats because it's it's 11 degrees out there right now and that's all the interior is really nice yeah it's like it feels so luxurious for a basic entry level car really nice overall the back seat looks nice as well yeah that's about it hope you guys like this video if you guys enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up or subscribe below and I'll do a comparison to my previous model IS250 compared to this and you guys can see how dated it looks for the previous one but as for performance I still prefer the previous IS250 or maybe th this model is fine but the previous engine that they have it in the IS250 that would be great I really don't fascinate the hybrid system though Alright, thanks for watching. Goodbye.